located on the famous heritage path of the central region. It is where the most unique ancient houses of Vietnam are kept. Where architectural buildings imbued with Vietnamese identity are restored. Where visitors can experience ancient housing space with interesting feelings. It is the enthusiasm of the people who want to save the beauty of Vietnamese architecture for the next generations. This site has been recognized as the biggest museum of ancient houses in Vietnam. Quang Nam is famous for Hoi an ancient town and my son sanctuary. These are two favorite destinations of visitors to the land. There is a new place in the area that attracts many visitors. It is Vina House Museum. A unique museum of Vietnamese ancient houses and architectural buildings, in Luqua Village, the Yen Ben Commune, Quang Nam Province. Lying on the path connecting the two world heritages of Quang Nam, my son sanctuary in Hoi an ancient town. Vina House space impresses visitors with its outer part. The typical feature is shown through the image of four wooden pillars, surrounding a square stone boulder, all lean on a cycad's tree as if it embraces strength and vitality creating a stable space of traditional Vietnamese culture. Especially, the three entrances to the museum are designed according to typical styles of the three regions of Vietnam. The entrance to Dong Bin Mon on the left is simulated and stylized from the gates of ancient Vietnamese people such as Hoi An and Northern Chang. It is normally called Chang Gate. The road behind the gate takes visitors to the inside space. On the two sides are two rows of yellow bamboo plants, which symbolize gentleman's spirit and willingness to receive bosom friends. This gate opens up to many houses. Could you tell me something about this first house? Right behind this northern style gate is a northern style house. It is called Phu Ong Din. Because it lies on a square space. And was built on a semi-circular lake. Therefore, it is also called Chudin Water Stage, where mandarins sat to watch water puppetry performances. The architecture of house is imbued with northern style with curved roofs. This thatched and bamboo house made according to Quang Nam style was brought and restored by Pham Thi So and Dian Nin, Dian Ban, Quang Nam. It is considered the ancient house with the highest number of farming and fishing tools in Vietnam. Thatched and bamboo houses have become familiar to many Vietnamese people. The house displays many farming and fishing tools. 
This area often suffers from floods so we can see a boat for the locals to use during the flood season. The thatch used for this house is of high quality. It is heat insulating. People have covered the roof with a thick layer of thatch, which can be used for more than 10 years. I can see many working tools made of bamboo and wood here. Yes. This is a typical house so the farming and fishing tools here are made from bamboo and wood environmentally friendly materials. Western visitors often call this house an eco house because if it is destroyed, it will not negatively affect the natural environment. The owners of the museum have restored not only the ancient houses, but also their living space for visitors to feel the unique features and the lifestyle of the ancient Vietnamese. Quang Nam House consisting of three compartments and four lean tos restored from the house of Mrs. Tran Thi Thao in Dai Phu Village, Dialog Commune. Quang Nam Province is considered the biggest traditional living house in Quang Nam. Recently, it was recognized by the Vietnam Book of Records Viet Kings, as the house with the highest number of pillars with 108 pillars, 76 of which are made of jackfruit wood and 32 of which are carved with sandstone. According to the owners of the house, it has been owned by nine generations of people with over more than 200 years. Northern people often use ironwood for their architectural buildings, while people in Kuang Nam often use jackfruit wood, which is popular in western Kuang Nam. Jackfruit wood is durable, hard to be eaten by woodworm, easy to be carved, and its color becomes more beautiful over time. This house is not only big, but also different from others in carving with unique stylized patterns. The ceiling patterns, typical for Dialog and Lysan Island, are subtly carved according to familiar topics such as four seasons, four supernatural creatures and eight weapons. They show the characters of their owners and the challenge of the carvers. Dialog area is home to a big sandstone mine. Earlier, Cham people used to take sandstone from here to build the imposing My Sun Sanctuary. Therefore, the owners of the house could easily build the pillars from sandstone to make them more endurable and beautiful. A house according to its first meaning is the place which meets people demand for residing and which helps people avoid being hit the harsh weather. Wrong, panel houses in Kuang Nam. With sloping roofs covered with yin yang tiles protect people from the sunny and rainy weathers of the central region. The roofs help rainwater run down easily and prevent the scorching sun from entering the house. Patterns are very subtle. Patterns are the spirit of the houses. 
expressing the owner's aspirations for their houses. That is why they pay much attention to the patterns, which convey the quintessence of the art of carving. Look at the ceiling, you will realize many sophisticated carving works. These patterns are typical for Dai Lok area, Dai Lai Sum, Kuang Kai. To assess the values of ancient houses, experienced people often look at their trusses. The trusses look like dragons creeping towards the eaves. One of the people who have made great efforts to protect the ancient houses is Le Van Vin, who comes from the famous Gimbong Carpentry village of Kuang Nam. From a small unit with 10 workers and artisans specializing in restoring ancient houses, Vina House, Vin Company, has restored more than 1,000 traditional wooden houses and dozens of thousands of wood carving works. Of 14 years of operation, Vina House Museum, with the motto of restoring Vietnamese houses, is proof of his effort to preserve the quintessence of Vietnamese carpentry. In late April 2014, the Kuang Nam People Committee signed a decision to establish Vina House Museum. This is the biggest private museum in Kuang Nam so far. Vina House holds many Vietnamese records for ancient houses, such as the oldest thatched and bamboo house in Vietnam, and the biggest traditional living house in Vietnam. The museum owners have prepared documents to ask for recognition of many other records such as the most unique ancient glazed bond in Vietnam. Coming to Vina House Museum, visitors can admire houses from different regions nationwide. The museum displays a boat station, a gold house of Ko Tu people from Quang Nam, a Hue Royal Octagonal House southern quadrangular and hexagonal house and so on. Each house has been restored according to their former design and surrounding living space. Now I will show you a special Vietnamese architectural style of Vietnamese house. Houses in shape of a conical hat. These houses are special because they have typical spaces. This space looks both modern and traditional with conical hats. There are two houses here. The one over there has been recognized by Viet Kings as the biggest eco-house in Vietnam. Especially, the roofs of the houses are covered with coconut shells taken from Benter Province, Vietnam. The coconut shells are very good because they are heat insulating and become more endurable over time. That is why we use them for the house. You said this is a conical architectural style. I am so surprised at the conical items here. This is a blend of modern and traditional architecture. The house is decorated with beautiful hats. I am holding a hat as well. This section includes three conical houses. Over there is a house with small hats. That is another house with bigger hats. This house is special because its roofs are not supported by a pillar in the middle, but by 17 surrounding pillars. These pillars were made of steel trusses. This area house has been considered by Viet Kings as the biggest eco-house in Vietnam. This house and the palm leaf conical hats remind Vietnamese people of their homeland. 
It also makes Guangnam unforgettable to foreign visitors. In a 2014 Vina House Museum received Viet King's certificate for the biggest museum of ancient houses in Vietnam. The recognition is worth the efforts that artisans and workers of Vina House, the manager of the museum, have made for the unique museum. Going through the ancient houses, visitors can admire the unique features and cultural values of the beautiful heritages, preserved well by Vietnamese people. We will find ourselves proud of the traditions and the talent of ancient people when arranging a space for daily activities and for worship. We will stay in Ishland forever with humanity. Vina House Museum gives visitors fresh feelings and encourages them to preserve traditional beauty. From the ancient houses to he-craft villages.